Hi there, I'm Roger Mullen. I'm the local member of parliament for Kirkcaldy and Cowden Beath. And part of that constituency is Delgetty Bay, which has had for 26 years at least an ongoing problem of radiation on this beach, which has never been tackled and never been cleared up by successive governments. So I set it as one of my tasks to at least make a serious attempt in parliament to put pressure on to get action. Well, the very first meeting at the MOD, I thought, I really want to let them know that I'm deadly serious about this issue. And I dug up some sand myself, and put it in a little plastic box, and when I went into the meeting with the minister and his officials, I started the meeting by saying, before we start discussing the issue, I've got a present for you, Minister. And so I then handed him and I said, here's a box of Delgetty Bay radioactive sand especially for you. For the next hour uh, of our meeting, it stayed there. Stunt as it was, it was actually helpful to get progress at the initial meeting. I'm Annabel Ewing. I am the SNP candidate for the Scottish parliamentary elections for the constituency of Cowden Beath. Um, I think it's a great pity for the people of Delgetty Bay that they are not able to utilise uh, the whole uh, of their, their coastline because of this very long-standing radiation problem a legacy of MOD activity and what we have seen under successive government, be it Labour or be it Tory, is a complete failure to act for the people of Dalgetty Bay and to get this problem solved once and for all. There's obvious frustration for people that they've got what could be a wonderful recreational area. We've got great sympathy for people who have been in the local community council and other bodies. that They've been valiantly trying to have their voice heard for at least 26 years. And for it still to be in the same condition today, but worse, must be incredibly frustrating. The previous MP had a little debate in Parliament about the issue. The coalition government ministers just stood up and ridiculed the fact that the person had been in power for 13 years and did nothing. And it has taken the election of an SNP Westminster MP Roger Mullen for the constituency to ensure that we start to see the MOD making good on uh, its promises issued many years ago now to proceed with a remediation plan. So I'm absolutely delighted that we are starting to see some progress. I would guess it will take at least £11 million and I think it will be reassuring once this project actually gets properly started. But I'm very hopeful that within a short period of time we're going to begin to see something actually happening on this site. I would really have great benefit having an SNP MSP working alongside me on this. If elected, I will be able, of course, to work very closely indeed with Roger to work as a double act to get the MOD moving and to get this problem sorted once and for all. The one thing that would be really good and really helpful for me is if people watching this voted SNP two votes at the coming Scottish Parliament elections.